Yes, sir. Another day just outside of Lay. I got a fender on the Saron. I kind of like it. It definitely fills out the front a little better. It might be a little long. I'm curious what you think. Uh, my plan for today is I'm going to take the pedal bike. I'm going to go work out. Watch my uh, Saron boot camp video if you're curious about how I do that. And then when I get back, I'll go on a joyride with the Saron and I'm going to film a 0 to 60 time and uh, use some telemetry data, which should be fun. bang out some work and then I'm gonna do that 0 to 60 video all right I banged out that work I'm gonna do my sort of usual safety check just to make sure the bike doesn't fall apart on me uh, I always start with the rear brake because uh, for the wheelies obviously I just shake it to make sure nothing's come loose check the rotor make sure it hasn't come loose and then I'll look at the, uh, the alignment of the rear wheel it's pretty common for it to get skewed a little bit after a couple rides this looks good check the chain tension it's almost always looser than I want but I'm but like whatever I'll leave it like that um, check the brake pressure make sure I don't need to bleed them feeling good check the front brakes give them a little visual inspection I'm gonna be running some telemetry data through the GoPro that I'll overlay on this video, give you an idea how fast I'm going throughout the ride. When it comes to the 0 to 60 test, I'll just use an app that'll be much more accurate. Here, I'm gonna turn it down from 7 to 5. 5 is my favorite wheelie power. It's like the perfect, the perfect amount. It is just a beautiful Saturday. Absolutely perfect weather. Great day to be out on the Saron. I'm gonna go for a quick joyride to get all warmed up before I do the zero to 60 test. Dude looked just like Elon Musk. That was crazy. <laughs> Testing ground right here. Oh shit, there are so many people. Looking good, guys. Well, I gotta download a 0 to 60 app. I'm downloading Drag Racer Car Performance 0 to 60. You alright? I'm all great, thank you. All right, I'm putting her into mode eight. Um, it goes up to nine, which is about 14 kilowatts, but uh, it's actually, it's too much, so I'm gonna do eight. And uh, the thing about the Emoto Bros controller, and let's remember this, is that it's not, it's not designed for zero to 60 times. It actually has a very mellow power output right off the bat. So I'm probably gonna full throttle it and I'll just slowly take off, so. If we were gonna compare these zero to 60 times with someone like Andy Harris from Surround Pit Stop, whose bike has 24 kilowatts the moment you touch the throttle, oh, yeah. he's gonna get way better zero to 60 times. This is just an idea of what you're gonna get with the Emoto Bros controller, and I'm running the 72 volt, 32 amp hour battery from Lightspeed, so let's check it out. Three, two, one. Yeah. 
it felt very stable. It really did. It felt very stable. Um, I should be doing this in like MotoGP gear, not in a t-shirt, but whatever. Look at that. Okay, so we did hit 60. We hit 60 in 6.8 seconds. I'm gonna screenshot this. Okay, I didn't like that app. Uh, it was being inconsistent. So I'm downloading another one. So far my times on that app are 6.8 and 7.7 .7 seconds, zero to 60. Let's see what this one says. The time to beat right now is 6.8 seconds. Let's see what we can bang out. Ready, three, two, one. So, so far I've gotten 6.8, 7.7, and 8.01. Honestly, I don't want to do another run. It's pretty demanding on the motor. Uh, if you look at Segway Up Jack, or Mayhem Jack, he, uh, he, he melted his motor going full throttle for more than like a minute. Hi. <laughs> Anyway, so I think I'm gonna stop there. Um, I guarantee you, if I if I put it into mode nine and made mode nine more kilowatts and you know had the balls to full throttle it, I'm sure, I'm sure the zero to sixty time would go way below six to eight seconds. So yeah, this was my little inconclusive estimation of zero to 60 times on the BAC 4000 from Emoto Bros if you're riding a reasonable amount of power. I think for all, for almost any rider, zero to 60 in eight seconds is such a thrill. It's well more than enough. And uh, you're not gonna be smoking, you know, the Teslas. This is definitely one of the fastest bikes you can get right now, so. You good, bro? Yeah. yeah. Hope you enjoyed this little video i know it wasn't a perfect zero to 60 test but it should give you an idea what kind of performance you'll be getting with the bike like this shout out to lightspeed and emoto bros for making it all possible uh, all the links are below um, as as always thanks for watching i really appreciate uh, all the support and uh go ahead and follow my instagram at sir and go peep the merch all the links are down below thanks a lot